All right, so I made a little washi wrapper for Christmas. Uh, my daughter's here in the room. If you hear her, she's uh, supervising today's recording. So these are all of the washi tapes that I'm using for December, and that's part of my whole decoration thing. Uh, no, you notice I'm still in my November planner here, but first I want to show you the spreads that I have set up so far for Christmas and where we are. So first I have a movies to watch list. I went through, I started with the list that I made like two years ago, and then I added a couple things to it, just, you know, searching like classic Christmas movies, Christmas movies for kids, now that we have a daughter and I want to kind of show her some of these. Um, and then I went through and I found out where I can actually watch each one of these. There's a couple that like are not available. I know like the Santa Claus was available last year on Netflix, but it doesn't seem to be this year. So, you know, it's not the end of the world if I don't watch that one, whatever, but... I still have never seen Die Hard, and it's been on my list, and I haven't watched it yet. Um, but yeah, these are the, the movies that I want to watch, and I just went ahead and like doodled the logo for the service that they are on. Um, and that will be the plan whenever I want to turn on a movie um, to either show Agnes or watch by myself. Um, my husband's not a huge fan of Christmas movies, so he doesn't really care one way or the other which ones we watch, but there it is. Then... Um, this, I think, show, I showed in my last flip through video. This is like my checklist of things I need to do for Christmas. Um, I still need to work on my daughter's wish list. That's not going to happen today. Um, but I do need to go through and schedule like tasks for our Christmas cards, like a deadline for getting them ordered, getting them sent, that kind of thing, and a schedule of when I want to um, organize or to do all the de decor and stuff. Um, in the meantime, I also have all of these. These got shown in the, um, the flip through video as well, but this is a freebie printable from the planner spot, um, the planner spot.com, I think. Um, and they were up for a limited time. So hopefully they're still available if you go and look for them. Um, but this is just like a gift list. So we've listed like everybody in our lives that we want to get a gift for. Some of them I've written like a, a target price. We have a couple of ideas of what we want to get people. Yeah. Thank you. But um, we don't really have, like, a list of everything we want to get just yet. But, um, so that's where we are right now, but we're using this as a, a starting point. I haven't done any shopping yet. I need to. But first things first. I've been in the stone color. You want to come help? <laughs> I've been in the stone planner for the month of November because it matched the color scheme that I was going for with the purple and green for my birthday month. But I've been missing the ochre. It's so pretty and I'm ready to move back into it. So first things first, I really need some new dividers. <laughs> I'm back in my Malden ochre. Um, I I missed it. 
I picked the, I've explained this before, I picked the gray stone color for last month because it matched, I thought, the purple and green theme better. But now that I'm in warmer colors for Christmas, uh, I'm back in the ochre and I really love this one. It's so pretty. It just, I don't know, something about it just feels really classy. All right, so um, the last thing I need to do to prep for, prepping for Christmas, as it were, um, is to schedule a couple of these tasks. Um, I've scheduled working on the baby's wish list. That's going to happen hopefully this week as I'm filming. Um, then I need to let's see. I have scheduled taking the photo for a Christmas card. Um, I should schedule looking at the list. Uh, let me see. I'm looking at um, like weekends and weeks that are less busy. So I'm going to be obviously off for Christmas, but before that, see, we're going to be out of town one day this weekend. So um, I think sometime this week here, this next week, I can, um, I should probably don't have to write the word Christmas. Christmas card list. This pen is starting to bug me. It's skipping. All right. List of people. I need to make sure I have everybody's addresses and stuff. And then also actually look into ordering them. I can do both of those sometime over this next week. Then um, the week after that, I'll have to work on sending cards. All right, we can do that. My plan is to take our photo over Thanksgiving. So that's that side of the page. And then on this side, let me just go ahead and pull this out. Uh, let's see. There we go. So I need to do, yeah, the outside lights are going to be a thing that happens over a weekend. So let's do that this weekend because we're going to be out of town here. We'll do the lights on the 14th. Lights. The wreath, I don't know when it's coming. Um, we ordered a wreath. I'm going to have to decorate it. Um, so at some point, let me see if I can sometime this week um, get wreath supplies. I'm going to have to go to like Joann's or something and get some ribbon and stuff to put on it. Then, yeah, the doormat, that's fine. The tr Like that's just a flop it down. Uh, the stocking is already done actually because it didn't end up going back into its box. It was just lying around the guest room. So when we cleared out the guest room, um, the, the stocking never went back in its box and the nail that's on the mantle, I couldn't pull out with my bare hands and I couldn't find the hammer like when I was thinking about it. And so those, uh, yeah, never really got fully put away all year. So it's already back up. Um, cause I just stuck it on the nail. I'm like, okay. Uh, the indoor lights and the outdoor lights, I think I'll just do the same day like last year. So we did the tree. Can we just do, I'll, I'll put tree here. If we feel inspired to do it earlier, then we'll just do that. I'll put up the tree on the 21st, put up the lights on the 14th. Okay. Because we put up our tree and our lights later and then leave them up all the way through the end of the Christmas season, which is like mid January. So that is, I think. I thought this was going to take longer. I've honestly, I've been putting off this. I've been putting off filming this video doing this for like weeks. Uh, and it was actually really simple. So now that everything on this list is checked off or moved somewhere, I'm just going to get rid of it. We're good. Everything is on here now. So at least there's a scheduled time to do it. That's really just what it comes down to is knowing that it's somewhere that you'll see it when you need to see it. So these, um, some of these tasks, they're like written on a specific day, but they really just need to get done that week. So that's generally these thing, these tasks here will just go on to my weekly. Um, and then that's, that's it. So here is my Christmassy setup. Uh, you didn't see all of this in my December plan with me. You just saw the actual monthly itself. So now we have all of the dividers in here. Um, 
I still have my November because I'm actually filming this in November. But there's the monthlies, all of the same stuff. And uh, yeah, it's really just the pretty dividers here. I like this one. That one looks cool. There we go. Since they're cardstock, um, I didn't laminate them. I just cut them up. I'm not going to be using them for very long. They don't have to be super durable. But I like this. So there we go. Thanks for sticking through with the video. Uh, the parts that were more or less boring, depending on your taste. I kind of tried to cater to everybody and therefore probably made it applicable to nobody. But if you enjoyed this, don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. I post videos twice a week and I'll see you in the next one on Thursday. Bye. Thank you.